hello hello friends how's it going everybody welcome in happy monday i'm sorry i'm late <laughs> so late to be honest i probably should have scheduled today as a day off but i always feel bad when i have like trips coming up i leave on saturday this week for a whole week so i always feel bad like not streaming for so long but i've only taken like one day off a week for the last few weeks i think Last couple weeks at least for sure and then no days off last this past week so this weekend was flat fest and whatnot so i'm here <laughs> i'm excited to be here actually i mean but i am doing something a little more chill just with pokemon um if folks want me to make a union circle let me know i'm more than happy to do that we got hyperspeed first boom welcome in as well so when you have so much wood in lego fortnite 1200 you'll probably have more than that after you take down all the monorails you have built everywhere <laughs> um i did while i was walking the dogs right before i started stream i did post the patch notes which got released for tomorrow's lego fortnite update it has a bunch of details about how the vehicles are gonna work um including like what items you'll need in the shop so you might want to check that out spin there is in the uh patch notes image at the top there is one flying vehicle it seems however that most of the things are not flying but there is one in the corner so it might just be more complicated there's not like pre-built <laughs> Sorry. Georgie. Georgie is climbing all over everything here to go grab him. Um, the vehicles are more complicated than what it seemed like they were going to be at first as well, too. So that's kind of cool, actually. It's not quite like... It doesn't seem like it's quite like a redstone Minecraft level complicated, but it is more complicated than what I was initially thinking, which would just be... Uh, just be like a better version of what we already had in the game um oh bella was here too i forgot to say hello to bella but bella said probably won't be here so bella's probably not here what am i gonna do what am i gonna do here in the pokemons um on our last stream i finished battling the elite four you're in indigo this of the BB Academy League. Um, and I also was like going through my Pokedex and see what else, what starters and whatnot I need to capture. Multiple copies of to finish up my decks. I have a lot of a lot of decks finishing to do, both in the main game still and here in the DLC waves. You have 1,000 granite as well, but that's a lot. That's a lot. Um, I think what I'm going to do, though, today is we're going to, like, finish, finish the story. Sorry, the dogs are being a lot, a lot. They're adorable, but a lot. What is this purple snake back here? Is that the regular version of that? I don't know what all the regular thing version of things look like, so I'm like, is that a shiny? It's not a shiny, but then I already have it. Update looks fire. I think I agree, Spoon. I agree. You looked at the patch notes. It's definitely what the what the game needed. And if they're gonna if they really did like focus more on like drivable vehicle like land vehicles this time it's possible that like they could do like as in depth with flying vehicles next time because it doesn't seem like like even if some of the systems that they have here work with flying vehicles we'll have to test that and see tomorrow um but Ooh, what's this what's this 
but that you can basically just like build an entire house on a on a drivable platform is pretty cool because that is one of the things that they show how many skins did they add to lego there's a lot there's a lot of new skins i didn't i don't remember the name of mr gator has been waiting for one of his for their signature skins I don't know if that got added or not. Hopefully it did. There's a lot of skins. But there's a lot of skins. I mean, there's thousands of skins in Fortnite, so it's still not enough. It's still got to keep going. Eventually, they want, I'm sure, like, everything. They do a lot of, like, the icon skins, so I think that part of that might be to try to get, get some of the big Fortnite content creators who have icon skins to make LEGO content. <laughs> <laughs> a little uh a little vanity vanity marketing i don't know if that's the right term for that or not but that's what i'll call it oscar is a villager yeah i saw that too um it sounds like certain villagers are going to be able to help you with some of the vehicle stuff too at the bottom of the nose. We'll go over all this in detail on tomorrow's stream. And we'll test everything out, but I just read through it really quick. I didn't get into all the nitty-gritty details. I'm just cruising around here. Uh I believe I have these. Yeah. That was that was the Pokemon, not me. He sounded a little bit like a toot. It was not me tooting. Just FYI. <laughs> was not a happy little toot. I mean, maybe it was the Pokemon tooted. I don't know. I don't know what the noise was. Is Oddish a starter? Let's look at the boxes. Ice cream as well? Oh, yeah. I saw, I saw that, too. Well, you gotta get snow for it. Oddish is a starter. Maybe I catch... I think this is how I do this. It's just when I'm just roaming around and I see a starter. I think I just catch the starter. Because I need three. Yeah, there is biomass, too. The biomass is gonna be... Kind of like the fuel... Or the power cells, it seems like. Give you a reason... That's smart, actually. It gives you a reason to, like... Um, have a farm. Consumable stuff like that. And it's like a renewable resource too, unlike, you know, Raid Core or something. Which is more renewable now than what it was, but it's still kind of a big pain to get. Pokemon. Oh, I don't have Sarah Ledge in my party. Sarah Ledge is the one that has the right move for this. Uh... uh... Draining kids? It's not very effective. It might take it out still though, because I'm way over its level. Use the holler to transport wood, pulling chests. Yeah, you can you could just put your whole house. Yeah, I might just do a whole mobile mobile house. I don't know. <laughs> you took all the bright core, you have 700? Oh my gosh. Been hoarding everything in the server. Interesting that they didn't give us the, uh, they still didn't give us the new, like, rift biome thing in the higher rarity weapons. I kind of was, like, those were rumored to come out so long ago, but that's why it's, like, you can't totally believe leaguers, because they don't really know, the, like, the timeline and stuff. I would have expected... Some kind of bigger update, though. I mean, this is it. What's coming tomorrow. But I would have expected this to come out, like, with the start of the new season as well. Just, like, but maybe they want to, like... I think they're doing this with Fortnite Festival as well, where they're kind of, like, spreading out stuff. Which makes sense. 
that way like at the end of a battle royale season maybe it's like when a lego fortnite huge update drops or a fortnite festival's huge update drops and that way people could will still be in doing stuff in fortnite if it's not battle royale because maybe they already finished the battle pass or maybe they're just burned out on battle royale for the season or whatnot Oh, one year anniversary? Oh, I don't think they'll wait that long. I hope they don't. That's a long time. Okay, I think I gotta go. I don't really know actually where I gotta go for this. I forgot. Um... If I had to guess where I have to go, I'd say probably the front of the school. Oh, yeah. Four types of wheels. Maybe the wheels, I don't know. Maybe the wheels are, uh, there's durability to them or something. Turnable wheels and powered wheels. So, powered wheels are basically like the old kind. Turnable wheels looks like they have like a. There was a leaked image of them. I don't think it's actually in that post though. Uh. They have kind of like a. I don't know what the word is. You probably know, Spin. <laughs> like steering mechanism on them. So there's different kinds of builds you could do with that, right? Like in a regular car, only the front wheels turn. But you could maybe make a some kind of like weird all-terrain vehicle thing if you had like multiple turnable wheels. I don't know. It might be one that's more like all-terrain like more like four-wheel drive or like big like on the if you look at the picture of the hauler maybe some of those uh, i guess all these vehicles that they show have those same wheels i don't know not sure we will have to see Load power centers up with power cells. I don't really see how you get the power cells. So is that the biomass? Oh yeah. Compost bin is a new station. Turns it resources into the biomass, fertilizer, or soil. Number and rarity of what spits out will depend on what you put in. You'll need great biomass to unlock the power cell recipe. Power cells also use glass. They added glass to the bandit camps. Drops. You're gonna need a lot of glass then. But glass is. Oh, wait. Glass it was bright core. Wasn't it? Isn't glass bright core and sand? I'm Googling before I start my adventure here in Indigo. This. Two sand and one bright core and one glass. Hmm. So. I guess you are gonna need a lot of that bright core there, Spoon. Glass is easy, the villagers can make it? Oh. Okay. The villagers can make it then then that's really nice. I can't ride my ride on him. Hit. You have a hundred glass? Wow. You ready to travel to area zero happy? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Splendid. We're finally ready to set off then. Are you two feeling well all right? Well enough to travel at least. Well, I'm uh I'm fine anyway. Yeah, me too. I've had time to calm down. Oh, well, that's good. I fine. I know what I have to do now. I'll find this legendary Pokemon in Area Zero. No matter what it takes. 
That's the spirit, Kieran. <laughs> I, don't, I don't think the teacher there, Miss Briar, I don't think she picked up the nuance of that statement. I'll do anything I have to to get that legendary Pokemon. Oh, good attitude. Um, all right then, shall we? Can villagers work at compost bins? Oh, no, no idea. Everything that we know about the update is in that post. Uh... Jules. The only thing it says about villagers is Jules comment and links will steer you in the right direction if you need a hand with vehicles. Probably though, because uh, uh, villagers can work at most of the other machines, right? We made it. I'm finally here. Area Zero, the place I've dreamed about for years. Whoa, this is incredible. Wowzas. Kieran's just gonna run off, huh? Uh, so you've been here before, right, Happy? Yeah, with my friends. Friends, huh? A gya? Eek, you scare me. Honestly, you're too big to come popping out like that. Yeah, watch my dan. A gya? So you came here with Happy back then too, huh? Oh, you must be that Pokemon that was reportedly first discovered here in Area Zero. I'm very intrigued by this specimen, but alas, that's not what we're here for. We're here to go to the deepest depths of Area Zero and see what's even deeper. What do you mean, even deeper? He mentioned in his writing that he fell from the depths to some place even deeper. Wait, hold on. Doesn't the depths imply he was as deep as he could get? Yes, it's quite curious, isn't it? <laughs> However, Heath also wrote that he was utterly unable to recall how he got down there. If his writings are to believe there must be an entire uncharted space below Area Zero. Well, either way, we should start by making the Zero Lab down in the depths. You take the lead, Happy. We typed this list on a Friday. Forget any. Uh, yeah, I saw that. Friday Royale is back in the game. Mm, interesting. I would have expected that to, like, not happen until after the patch. Never really do anything in Party Round. Unless, unless every once in a while they've had, like, challenges or quests in there. Uh... We're just going in. For real, though. Actually, this is good. I need to come back down here again anyways, because... I'm not sure... What happened to the other Maridon? I might need to trade him. <laughs> To get a cool ride on. I'm not exactly sure where here I'm supposed to go. This is the devs for sure. The Team Rumble is down. That's so weird that they're taking stuff off when they're not in downtime. It can't be this, right? No. But I'll take this, whatever it is. Oh, a terror shard. That's actually kind of valuable. Just be in a random corner of a random room in a random spot. I feel like my map is not updating correctly. I did, uh... Oh, I think we found the spot. Whoa.
Whoa, this place is insane. It reminds me of the Crystal Pool. This is the Zero Lab, I take it? The structure's exterior matches Gita's description, at least. So this is the deepest point in Area Zero. Well, I mean, sure. Well, yes and no. Yeah, I mean, that's what I was going to say. <laughs> the depths. Deepest point Area Zero expedition managed to reach a long time ago. You know, I've been told the lowest level of this lab contains a mysterious room whose purpose is entirely unknown. However, where I want to go is even deeper than that. So you're saying we should head inside this zero lab? Gates closed though. Huh. Oh, you're right. What do we do now, Happy? You've been here before, right? Uh, use the panel? Wowzers, this feels like a spy movie or something way cool. What? I didn't say anything. Hee 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 hee. Well then, can we count on you to unlock block the gate, Happy? Sure, I guess. Totally doing Miss Briar's evil bidding unknowingly here. Both the known and the unknown. Open the gate to zero lab, sure. Why not? Access revoked due to prolonged inactivity. Entrance locked. What's the matter? Is something wrong with it? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. It opened before though, right? Is there some extra step we're missing? Uh, the professor was in the lab and... Uh, I see. So last time you went through a series of steps to unlock the gate. And the professor was also there to guide you from the inside. Beep boop. Indigo disc detected. Indigo disc detected. Beep boop. Huh? It's talking. Insert Indigo Disc for greater access privileges. Please insert Indigo Disc. Relax, it's just one of those computerized voices. It's not any different than like a TM machine. Hmm? Indigo Disc. What could it mean by that? Well, let me tell you. Gita gave me a mysterious item before we departed. You think that's it? Ooh, how fun. Go on, Happy. Do it. You have my permission. Please insert in the go disc. In you go disc. In the go disc confirmed. Beep boop. Zero lab elevator redirected the area zero zero under the abs. Rumble rumble. Beep boop. Beep boop. Green pizza door. Interesting. Interesting. They made Ninja Turtle pizza. Let's head on in. It's when you expected something to change in Battle Royale. Uh, I mean, I don't know if it's, I don't think it's getting unlocked tomorrow, but we will be getting the Korra, um, secret skins and the quest for that while it's be in the game, but I think that's unlocking later with an event. We'll see. It, there might be a, I don't think they released the full patch notes for the regular Battle Royale stuff yet, so there might be other changes. Uh, it's way too dark in here. I just smacked my head on something. That's because you're just running around without any idea where you're going. Wow, Kiki. Wow. Sounds like someone's finally breaking out of their funk, huh? Shut it. Where's Miss Briar, anyways? She's busy rummaging through, like, a whole stack of documents there. Aren't those someone's private photos and stuff? We probably shouldn't be looking at all that. Huh, you're awfully considerate all of a sudden. Miss Briar, look, an elevator. Maybe it can take us down further. You want to go down, right? Hmm? Down, you say. Oh my, did you use this elevator last time to reach the mysterious room I mentioned there? there? I think so. Oh, did you already forget what happened last time you were here? 
Perhaps this is a side effect of prolonged exposure to Area Zero. Well, we've got no time to waste. Let's go down. I'm just a little, a little suspicious of you, Miss Brian. I think you might have some ulterior motives. Oh, wonderful. This elevator just keeps going further and further down. Uh, that's what elevators do. You know, it's moving pretty fast, actually. It almost feels like I'm floating. Hey, everyone. That panel we used to unlock the gate. Didn't it say something about where the elevator goes? Now that you mention it, yeah. Something about the elevator being redirected, right? As far as I know, there's only one elevator inside the Zero Lab. So the panel must have been referring to the elevator we're currently inside. So where exactly is this thing taking us? Ho 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 ho. Where indeed? Hmm? Hmm? Slow, dramatic pan. Fade to black. They're all like, oh my. Oh my goodness. I mean, did you not join us for the rest of the walk? It looks very similar. So what, are we under area zero or something? Yes, according to my data, our current position is far deeper than we were last. Could the elevator have taken us even further down than its previous destination? Yeah. <laughs> Man, the area zero was already already a lot to take in. I don't think anything's gonna surprise me at this point, no matter what we run into. Uh hey. Uh what's all this stuff? Hmm? Oh what are desks doing down here? Oh my, oh my, this is this is a report written by the esteemed Professor Turo. A massive cavern exists beneath Area Zero, and there slumbers Terrapagos, the hidden treasure of Area Zero. Its body has become crystal, protecting it from hostile outsiders. It appears that rousing it will take some time. In this cavern, I witnessed the terrestrial phenomenon occurring in a way I've never seen above ground, terrestrialization that appears to hold the power of every known type of Pokemon. I've dubbed this terror type the stellar type for now. Could Terrapagos influence be at play? Rapagos is the hidden treasure of Area Zero? And it's slumbering in the form of a crystal? And what is this about a stellar tear type? Brilliant. Absolutely marvelous. You think there was so much that Heath didn't write about? These documents are a veritable treasure trove. And we've only just begun our expedition. I don't know how she can get so excited in a bizarre place like this. Legendary Pokemon to Rapagos. That's the hidden treasure of Area Zero. Come on, let's hurry up and go further in. I still haven't got my fill of these documents, but okay, let's go. It'd be best to discover the truth with our own eyes, after all. Would it, though? <laughs> There's some mysterious and possibly dangerous thing. Should, shouldn't we figure out what it is first? Uh, let's keep moving. Stay on guard, everyone. Uh, are we going to do zero build tomorrow? No, I... I have stuff going on in the evening, so I can just do the Lego Fortnite. Um, I don't, I don't think I'm gonna be able to do anything on the other channel, honestly, all week. Sadly, sadly, just because I got a lot, a lot going on, in order to get ready to leave on my trip on Saturday. So, What is this? It's like a crystal trying to be a flower. It's completely blocked the path. Yeah, we're not going any further with this thing in the way. Hey, what, a, what about Wachimadan? That Pokemon you read on, could it smash through? Uh, I'm not so sure. Hold on, hold on, please, hold on. This is quite likely a manifestation of pure terrestrial energy. We have no idea what might happen if we try to destroy it with brute force. 
Okay, so what do we do then? Hmm. Mm. Glee, glee, glee. There are Pokemon all the way down here. And what's going on with this one? It seems to be charged with some kind of strange energy. Hey, get back. You know you're no good in a battle, Ms. Briar. Kiki, no, happy. You should handle this. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Mora. Go Tingadan. Ooh, it immediately terrestrialized. Oh. It has the stellar. What on earth is that energy? It it couldn't be. Gigaton hammer. Can I catch this thing? <laughs> that would be real nice. <laughs> uh, I can't. I can't. Uh, but let me give a little smoochy smooch with Tingadun. Raining kiss, the sludge wave. Super effective, and the Gomora things. Good work, Abby. Whoa. It disappeared. Did knocking out that sparkling Pokemon make the crystal flower disappear? It's just like in that report we found earlier. What we just witnessed was a Pokemon wielding the powers of each and every type. That means it must have had the stellar terror type. Uh, so what's all that mean? Wait, was that supposed to be the so-called hidden treasure we're looking for? Hmm. I can't say for certain, but no, I don't think so. The professor's note said the hidden treasure of Aerie is slumbering in crystal form. The Glomoria just fought off doesn't fully fit that description, so I don't think it's the Pokemon the professor called Terrapagos. Well, the only way to know if it was the hidden treasure or not is to keep going. Come on. Limit crystals. Interesting. Oh, I don't have this. What is it? It's like a tiny EV in a bucket. <laughs> Carving. Jewel Pokemon Rock and Berry type born from the high temperatures and pressures deep underground. It defends itself by firing beams from the jewel part of its body. Huh. Interesting. Interesting. Do you think that this Glamour isn't sparkling the way the other one was? So I don't think it has filler type. How did they all get ahead of me? How are they already there? Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> I bet the path will open up if we can defeat that sparkly Pokemon up there. Well, what are you waiting for? Hop up your watch, Madonna, and get over that cliff. Oh, 
up there. So it, the frame rate is so low, I didn't even think it was a real thing. <laughs> Now that's better. What is it? Wow, there. I haven't seen these. Smash is smash. Interesting that these fights are so much less difficult than the BB League Elite Forward. And clear in. I would have thought they would have like scaled it, but. I guess they didn't really scale everything else in the rest of things either. Good job, Happy. The crystal thing is gone now. I almost just plummeted my doom. That Pokemon's called Noretta, right? Boy, it can really jump. We're on a roll. Let's keep moving. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So sparkly. I wonder if I'm able to come back down here. Regularly. Do we need to fight that? Is there another block thing? Probably, huh? I wonder if I need to do the dialogue, though. I'm sure it's fine, right? Right? What could possibly go wrong? random for it? No, it's a different one, right? What does have the stellar shape? Oh, it's iron for it. Okay. Definitely using draining gas. <laughs> Reese for some health, nothing else. Well, that didn't really do much though, did it? 2 HP? That was enough though. That was enough to at least break the. The terrestrialization. Iron Thorn Stains. Why do they have the same reaction every day? They're like amazed. Like, ooh, 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 ooh. Hey, Happy, the path opened up. Imagine. <laughs> imagine. Oh, Bear says hi, by the way. <laughs> Oh, 
Here's also excited about the path opening up, apparently. Sorry, we have you doing all the hard work. We really appreciate it, Happy. Now then, it appears the terrestrial energy around us is growing even more dense the further down we go. Come, we've no time to lose. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. For some reason, her earrings match, match the uh, symbol at the top of these stellar Pokemon. Little ring pop head pieces. Curious, curious. I thought that was like a really deep pool or something. I guess not. Um, J-Man, hello, hello. Keyboard did win. Yeah, go, 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 go. GG's though. I mean, I feel like... I would have guessed, honestly, that... Drums maybe would have won. Drum was really strong in my matches, but... Who knows? Oh, this is, this is getting harder here. I haven't even tried this steel beam yet. Downtime update for Fortnite? Yeah, there's the uh, big Lego Fortnite stuff out tomorrow. Hearable vehicles. And then it also adds all the stuff for the um, Legend of Korra Avatar The Last Airbender event later in the season. I'm actually going to swap monsters here because nothing hurt. I don't know if the Legend of Korra stuff is starting tomorrow, but it might not start till the next day. Or, like, a future time, but they're adding it in right now, anyways. You're playing Fortnite, and you got notice for downtime. Nice. Yeah, downtime's not for a while, though. I don't think it starts till, like, 1 a.m. Pacific or something. Hmm. I didn't even see where that crystal there at was at. But I guess it was way behind me. Okay, Kiki, your turn to call over Happy. Like before, it looks like a big update. Uh, it is. They released patch notes already. I have that linked on my community tab. It adds um, drivable, steerable vehicles. We had vehicles, but you couldn't really control them at all. So they weren't really that useful. But this, you can like, you can build the whole house that shows in the one of the images. <laughs> on the back of a truck thing. And drive it around so that way you can have like a mobile base kind of thing which is pretty cool makes it uh gets rid of one of the biggest issues with the uh, lego fortnite survival mode which is just getting around going to different biomes and whatnot it's a big pain going between bases emma hello hello emma were in the like very sort of end game of indigo disc the final battle stuff so i'm not sure if you've done that part if you haven't you might want to go away to avoid spoilers <laughs> like it was for anybody else too quit your blabbering just do it <laughs> the path opened up we can keep going 
Why is that even necessary? Like, we can just keep doing the same thing. Oh, I'm getting stellar Terra shards? Whoa. So am I going to be able to turn anything then into a stellar type? Because normally you need, what, like 50 of them, I think? Interesting. Wow, Kiki, isn't there something you wanted to say to Happy? No, not really. Just feels like we're all relying a bit too much on him is all. We should keep going. Ah, he's so stubborn. Ha 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 You two are simply dazzling. As always. Just so you know, we were also fending off wild Pokemon while you were away. Me and my team are just about spent. Sinus does all I've got left, so if something happens, you better save me. <laughs> okay. Okay. I actually should. Speaking of, speaking of. Let me open up my bag and, uh. Oops. Let's auto heal. And we'll be on that as well. And I actually need to like refresh moves probably for Inkatan with something. Elixir. I guess he's this because I haven't really. Oh, I'm doing that the wrong way. Um, restore health. Giga Gun is really what I need the most of, but. Raining kiss, I guess, as well. Okay. My terror orb. I think it's reacting to something. Huh. You're right. Mine is too. I'm picking up a truly astounding level of terrestrial energy. It seems to be coming from in there. Are we finally at the finish line? The hidden treasure. Hey, where do you think you're going? Ooh, I can't wait another second. The truth behind the Violet Book is so close now. What? Not you two. Those two sometimes, I swear. No swearing. No swearing, Carmine. Well, that is quite the crystal. It's huge. So sparkly. What is this place? The vibes here are on like a totally different level. The hidden treasure. Where is it? Hmm? There, Kieran, up ahead, there's something among those pillars. It matches her earring. The stones, the hidden treasure? Give me a moment, I just need to check something. If I can get the hidden treasure of Area Zero, I can finally be happy. Iki, you're still going on about that nonsense. Jadid says, Happy has everything I've ever wanted. He's got strong Pokemon. He can go anywhere he wants, and he can be friends with anyone. I loved Ogre Pond since forever ago, but even Ogre Pond chose him over me. But Kiki, you did your best too. Even you, sis. 
you were being all nasty toward him at first, but then boom, you were like best friends in no time. I, well, I've got nothing. I worked so hard and for what? I still lost in the end. This is all I have left now. Found it. The crystal is definitely what we're looking for. Go on, Kieran. Pull with everything you've got. Show us the hidden treasure of Area Zero. Fade to black. <laughs> Whoa. Maybe got any super glue. There's no doubt in it. This crystal must be Terrapagos. Da 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 da. <laughs> Oh, it's just, a, it's just a little baby guy. Oh, the little sparkle eyeball is so cute. Purple and teal and pink. Interesting color scheme. No. You're mine. A master ball. And just like that. You're in. Catches. Arapagos. In a purple and teal ball. A purple and pink ball. <laughs> that was Terrapagos? You caught it, right? <laughs> Finally. Very well done, Kieran. The fact that you brought along a master ball tells me you're pre well prepared for this. Now I can study Terrapagos whenever I want. But there's no time like the present. I think you could give us a little demonstration. Of Therapagos' power right now. Well, you heard her, Happy. I'm also itching to see what Therapagos can do. Get ready so we can start. If you stay ready, you don't have to get ready, Kieran. Yes. <laughs> Alright, get in position. I hope you brace yourself. This time, I'll definitely beat you happy. You are challenged by Pokemon Trader Giran. Who throws out the Rapagos? Go, Tinkadon. Go, Terrapagos. Show happy what you're made of. I don't know that it's leveled up enough. Oh. Baby eyes poke. Whoa, whoa. It's, it's, it's got some a teal hoodie. It's not terrestrialized yet, though. So, this is the hidden treasure's true form? With this, I can win for sure. Made it shell gleam. Smash, smash. Super effective. I can't I can't change the camera angle, which means Tinkaton's just like in the way. Oh no. Tinkaton down already? Critical hit. You know what we have to do, right? Right? Ogre Pond. It's a, a psychological warfare with Kieran. Users attacks to target with great power. This also lowers the user's attack and defense stance. Let's do it. Huh? It has a weakness? I thought this was the hidden treasure of Area Zero. Ogopon's defense falls. Trapagos' power should be far greater than this. Could it be? We're missing something. 
uses Zen head, but uh, I don't know these moves. I just added a lot of these. Um, I beat Bujo. Smash, smash. Rafa goes spins. Didn't even terrestrialize. Why didn't Kieran terrestrialize? Why? Why? I thought if I just had the rapid ghost, if I had the hidden treasure of Area Zero, it, it will make me stronger. I thought it'd let me be happy. Kiki, that's enough. It's time to stop this. No. Something's not right. Its terrestrial energy output is far too low. Not to mention the fact that it looks different from the illustration in the Violet book. So Terrapagos isn't the hidden treasure of Area Zero? No, I'm uh, sure that it is. But we must be missing something. A way to transform it into the treasure. Hmm? Of course. It's made of terrestrial energy. Here and you must terrestrialize Terrapagos this instant. If my hunch is correct, Terrapagos will resonate with the energy from your terror orb. And the hidden treasure will finally reveal its true brilliance. Got it. Whoa, I knew it. The Violet Book was right. The Rapago said it's fully awake in the form. This is the hidden treasure of Area Zero. Oh, it's so cool looking. Whoa. All of the budget for this whole DLC just all went into these visual effects. <laughs> mm -hmm. Knowing glance, knowing glance. Things are getting out of control, Kiki. You should return to Rapagos to its ball. Oh, okay. Come back to Rapagos. Oh, uh. What? Huh? It won't go back inside. Why? What have you done, Kiki? What have you done? Go, Lucario. Why Lucario? <laughs> its energy output is going to hit while we're all in serious danger if we can't bring it under control. I'm sorry, kids, but please, you need to stop the Rapagos. Come on, Kiki, you need to do something, too. We've got to get the Rapagos under control. No, no. This wasn't supposed to happen. This is all my fault. Oh, this is a, 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 uh, this is Carmine's Pokemon. Not inviting it. That's not what I was expecting, but okay. Um, Meteor Mash. I think I want Fairy Moves, not the Steel. Yeah, <laughs> I really should swap Pokemon here. Um, it's using a barrier to reduce damage. In that case. Terrestrializing your Pokemon might help. Uses Terra Star Storm. Whoa. It didn't really do that much. <laughs> Ooh, actually, that, that was kind of nice. Um, this is Bullet Punch. I think I'm gonna have to swap. I think I'm gonna have to swap here. Oh no. Now's your chance to use terrestrialized Pokemon and strike back. I, I can't terrestrialize yet, can I? Oh, I can. Um. Uh, 
and that would still be on. Then this shot goes down. I don't know why. Carmine didn't harass lights. Oh no, my Sinistra is knocked out. This isn't good. It's just too strong. Uh, oh my. Wait, what? <laughs> Eep. Oh no. That's bad, that's bad. Um... Eep. This could be really bad. If Sylveon goes down here. Okay. We're fine, we're with the shield. That should heal back up the full. Welcome back, Spoon. Oh no. What? It absorbed the Rastal energy. But Cartmine still has her orb. It reshielded. Oh no. Use the power of the Terrastal phenomenon to change its type. It put up another barrier of strength. It just used Terrastal energy again? You need to get in there and battle Kiki. Happy's doing all the work. It's no good. I'm useless. When you didn't hear it, I said no. <laughs> I, I have other stuff going on tomorrow evening, so I can just do like a Fortnite. I don't think I'm going to have a chance to stream at all on the second channel actually this week because I leave for my trip on Saturday and I got a bunch of stuff to do. So I could probably just stream here on this channel this week. We'll see. I might be might be able to do one one day of on the other channel, but probably not. Probably not. Just depends though. Um well, I can't terrestrialize again. Oh, but I can if I attack more, okay. Then let's see. All mind again? Yeah, I don't know if this is gonna work or not, but we'll see. Ooh. No, that's not nearly enough help. I'm gonna have to do this. Uh. Hmm. I think I max. I think I max potion the Sylveon, and then, then when I have a chance to max revive the Inkaton. Oh, nice. Sylveon avoided the attack. Perfect. Um. 
I'm, I'm taking a page out of my Charizard's Heaven Star Raid strategy here. With a Calm Mind's. Let's hope it works. <laughs> Try this. Let's try a hyper beam. I might need I might need to do more call mines though. Oh. Oh. No. <laughs> it's not nearly enough damage. Now happy thrust laser Pokemon so it shines once more. Yeah, but isn't it just gonna steal my energy again? Oh. No. Rubion. I don't think the uh it's a I don't actually know what type it is right now. This is just stellar type? It said it changed types. I think I spiky shield and then try to max revive the King of Tons. It should get her, and I should be fine. And then uh, let's try this. I don't know if this is gonna work or not. Oh, it did okay. I was probably just going to steal my terrestrialization again. Well, that's fine. I should actually just be able to sustain with the uh, spiky shield. Which absorbed terrestrial energy yet again. Surely I can't keep doing that over and over, though. Surely, surely. Kiki, Happy's in trouble. You need to help him. But, but I can't. I can't help anyone. Let's do it together. Our friendship. Yeah. <laughs> the power friendship courses through Kieran's veins. I drapples. Super sweet syrup. It shields a third time and changes his type a third time. <laughs> okay, I'll help out too. Honestly, better late than never, I guess. The two of you need to clean this whole mess up. I don't think the spiky shield counts as an attack, even though it does do some damage. I guess I can check the barrel orb. Let's see. Kieran does not have a That's not gonna do much. Oh no. Yeah, I should have waited. It's okay. It did all the damage before when I was terrestrialized.
Let's see though. One more attack. So then I think the spiky shield did count. So I think I spiky shield and then they should be able to thrash slice the Z bomb one more time. Just now it's getting bombed. not gonna let me okay so i do actually i have to do it another attack then um so we'll see bomb and then we should be able to thrash slice and then see bomb again or draining punch if we need to between there I think I'm gonna terrestrialize and drain punch. I really want to see bomb with the terrestrialization because it's not the same typing, but it should at least like help me sustain. So that I can set that up for the next turn. Doing the seven star raids definitely has really helped my like strategy in terms of battles and whatnot because before I had really had no idea what I was doing. I was just like spamming different things. This definitely would have been a lot tougher. Oh nice, that should have cracked the shield, no? It looks like it just barely didn't. Um, but terrestrialized seed bomb should do quite a bit. If it doesn't take it out, it'll get close. Or just goes to the shield level. Uh -huh. Okay, that's kind of a bummer, actually. This is fully gonna steal my energy again, isn't it? No, maybe not. Maybe not. This seems like a power down there. It looks like I can't absorb any more energy or put up another barrier. Time to attack! And to end this, you two, you have my permission to go all out. Okay. <laughs> This should be this should be relatively easy then. It should just be one shot from here. There we go. That's it. I knew you could do it. Rafa goes faint. Maybe it'll go inside a ball now. I know I can count on you, Happy. You got this. I could put it in a master ball. I don't actually know. I don't. I haven't used a master ball before. Uh, Terrapagos. Um, hmm. Hmm. It is the perfect color. <laughs> or we do this, or do this, because this also works. I'll do this, because I. I don't want to waste your Master Ball. Ooh, the like Pokeball like terrestrialized there. Rapagos was caught. Is it is it over? Is everyone okay? We're fine, don't worry. 
Oh, thank goodness. What a relief. I let my obsession lead you all to a very dangerous situation. It's simply inexcusable. I'm so sorry, everyone. You should be. You're completely fixated on this terrestrial stuff. You gotta keep your obsessiveness in jag. Yes, you're absolutely right. I messed up too. I looked at the happy for so long. I wanted to be like him so badly. I didn't know what else to do. But I guess I just don't have any to be like him after all. Finally, finally, I can let it go. Don't sell your don't sell yourself short. But sniffle. I just sniffle sniffle. Wow. I swear, I've got such a silly little brother. Sniff. You finally let it go. Wow. What? What is the, why are they crying like babies? Oh, you two must have been so scared. But you all shone brilliantly just now. You were truly dazzling. And in the end, our happy even managed to catch Therapagos. So I think we can consider our little expedition into Area Zero good and finish. Time to head back to the Blueberry Academy. Big sniff. Wham. I was I was kind of expecting her to be more evil than that. Maybe maybe it's not over yet. I mean she did almost get us killed. I need to get in touch with Gita. Hey, uh, happy. Look, I I know I caused a lot of trouble for the league club and everyone. I wanted to give everybody a proper apology. Including you, Happy. So, I'm sorry. And, uh, I guess what I'm trying to say is... I want to make things right. So, do you think... We could start over from zero and be friends again? <laughs> hey... We're going to leave you two behind if you don't hurry up. The, like nostalgic Animal Crossing music in the background here. Well, that's so pretty. That's it. That's it. There is an epilogue. So we're going to try to do the epilogue today too. Because I want to be done with the story. Do, 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 do. I get stuck. World's too loud. Who is that? Am I going to get copyright struck with this music? Is this Ed Sheeran? Do I need to mute? <laughs> I think I probably should mute. Uh, not that it matters that much, but... Oh, it won't really be a real strike. It'll just be the other, the other thing, but... Mute just in case. Oh, that's the wrong music. Get some Pokemon. Poke and chill on. Wait, wait for the credits here.
I'm looking at the Lego Fortnite stuff while we're doing this. <laughs> so one of them, there's three different vehicle types. The ones like the Speeder is one person vehicle. Looks like it's really tiny. It's ideal for zipping from biome to biome. Off-roader is like a four person vehicle. Perfect for carrying around multiple passengers. Unlock the recipe, adding flexwood your inventory and then the hauler is the big one the chonker that you could build a little house or the move base on i think i build the hauler the hauler also has um four seats it's basically it looks like a off-roader thing but with the other uh, with a big platform on the back and extra wheels and the room up front it looks like for maybe a jazz mm, oh, sorry i don't have these up on the stream i probably should but we're watching the credits also <laughs> i swear i'm watching the credits it's important I'm gonna, uh, once the credits end here, I'm gonna take a really quick break and go refill my water because I'm out of water too. What oh, is a Celeste? It is an Ed Sheeran remix. No! Fully getting a copyright strike. It's a claim, not a strength. Thank you all too for getting us past our first like goal. If you haven't already, do me a quick favor, hit that thumbs up button, like button on the stream. The hidden treasure of area zero. That's cute. The end. Well, that was a picture from our my time in Kitakami too, because I had the other haircut. <laughs> okay, let me turn the game sound back on. Ed Sheeran is hopefully over. Bing bong, bing bong. This is an announcement for the following student. Happy from Uba Academy. Miss Briar would like to see you in classroom one four. She has some important news to share with you regarding the terrestrial phenomenon. Bing bong, bing bong. Pass from one four, please. Be happy, glad to see you, glad to see you. You feeling rested and recovered after a big adventure down in the under, that was... No? Sure. Oh, youth really is an enviable thing. I'm still feeling all wrung out despite having been back for a while now. It's been like one minute, but on to why I called you here. Since our return, I've been writing up everything we discovered on our expedition. Honestly, I've hardly slept. I obtained Gita's permission to turn it all into a book, but don't worry, I've made sure to skip a few details and omit the names of those involved, so voila. A proof copy of the book, freshly delivered from my publisher, just for you. There's the book, a proof copy of the exploration notes covering the area of zero under depths. It's filled with long paragraphs describing what happened, along with Briar's thoughts. I behaved recklessly in the under depths. I don't know what we would have done if it weren't for you. You truly deserve a copy of this book. I just hope it's sufficient as an apology. Ah, uh, but there was something else I needed to check with you. Would you mind showing me your tarot orb, Happy? Hmm, I thought as much. It's behaving just like Kieran's and Carmine's orbs. I think it might be because your orbs were directly exposed to the energy from Therapagos. Kieran and Carmine say that ever since the Under Depths, they've been able to terrestrialize their Pokemon without charging their orbs. 
Hmm? Actually, there's one more piece of news I should share with you related to those Dibas devs. You know the terrarium core that hangs from the ceiling of the terrarium? Well, until now, it had been popping, keeping it topped up with a mixture of Paldean soil and water from the crystal pool in Gitagami. That's how we've been able to stabilize the terrestrial phenomenon on our academy grounds. But the other day, I tried adding crystals I'd collected from the underdeps to that mix, and it caused the properties of the core to change. The result? Pokemon shining in rainbow colors have started appearing all over the terrarium, and they have the stellar Terradide. Thanks to this, my research into the terrestrial phenomenon is shining brighter than ever. Whoa, that's actually a pretty big deal. Stellar Terra type terrestrialization grants a boost to moves, but only once per move type. After you use a move, no other moves of that type. Same type will get the boost in Terra Raid Battles. All moves will be boosted without limit. Oh, and there was one last thing. Man in a blue suit was looking for you over by the entrance to the academy. That's all we have to report for now. Thanks for setting aside some time to chat. I'm off to pay a visit to my publisher. I'll leave you to it. Next time we meet, I'll ask you for a good long look at Therapagos. Till then. Doodaloo. I, I added the doodaloo. <laughs> um, it's not super important for the epilogue or anything, but out of curiosity. I do want to know. Oh. Hmm? There you are, Happy. Just the person I was looking for. I heard the news. You're the new BB League champion, am I right? I'll admit it. I'm blown away. Inviting you to this academy was the best decision I made recently. So, now that you've had some time to get comfortable here, how do you find Blueberry Academy? Having fun? I love it here. I love it here. Sure, yeah. Good, good, just what I'd like to hear. Anyways, there's a small favor I'd like to ask of you, Happy. You see, the whole academy has become so much more lively and energetic since you came. And that got me thinking maybe we should have even more people come visit from Paldea. Have them come as special coaches or something. You know a lot of people, right? You got lots of friends and everything. I mean, like teachers from your school, gym leaders, that sort of thing. Oh, and any strong friends of yours are also welcome here. Leave it to me. Spoken like a true champion. I knew you were the right person to ask. I knew it. I knew it. You can use the Clubroom computer to contact anyone you want to invite. Oh, but it's, it'll cost you BP. We'll need to pay for their trip and such. Here's something to get you started. Two hundred? Two hundred? That's it? I think I'll arrange for the special coaches to stay in this club room when they're not teaching. You should have a chat with them while they're here. Now then, I'll leave you to it. Enjoy. Using the PC in the League Club Room, you can invite your friends and acquaintances from the Paldea region to visit Blueberry Academy as special coaches who you can talk to and battle with. You can have a max of two visitors at a time. Would you like to print some items? I want to make it better. It'll cost 1,000 BP to make a group of item printer. Is that okay? Sure. Roger that. Hiya. A little grease here and... Uh, Phew, the item printer's final upgrade is all done. The item printer can now print multiples of the same item. And it can print stellar terror shards now too. Oh, also, it doesn't help the item printer work any better, but it made it look like a master ball. I really appreciate you taking part in our research now that it's all done. Would you like to print some items with the printer? Sure, let's do it. That's what I want. That's what I wanted to know. Um, auto select 10 print jobs. Actually, I might be able to do more print jobs at once now, too. I think. I'm not sure. Love the color scheme. Love the color scheme. My design, by the way, was not inspired by a Master Ball. It's a coincidence. <laughs> All done. I'll go ahead and put these in your bag. Uh, let's see. Can we really only do 10? Oh yeah, you can only do 10 at a time, but that's fine. We'll do a few more. This is a really 
you can make a lot of money doing this. You need money for items or leveling up a Pokemon for seven star battles or anything like that. What well, masterpiece key cub? A razor claw, a bunch of parish cards. And the, to do this, you just need the um, the blueberry points. Ooh, ooh, something, something special is happening. What is it? We got a bunch of gold items. There are three gold items: a star suite, an amulet coin, and a lucky egg, and a, a bunch of max revives. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> Two X item bonus activated. Ding. What do we get? Nothing that great. But then, I don't think. Actually, it's a lot of terror shards. 32 for grass shards. 20 dragon. 12 fire. Useful. Is this the shards are what you need to change the terror type? It's not everything can be stellar. I actually don't know if the stellar thing is good or not. I kind of been like avoiding hearing anything about it. I like vaguely knew there was something with multiple terror types, but that's it. Um, nice, nice. Do a few more. Rainbows, rainbows. The Pokeball Lotto. I think you can't even get Master Balls this way. I'm not sure though. But basically, it picks from different rare Pokeball types. Let's see what we got. One is very rainbow and sparkly. Oh, it is a Master Ball. Whoa! I guess I could have probably got Rapagos in a Master Ball then. I didn't know that for sure. Only one of them, but still. What do we get? What's the cool sparkly thing? Big nuggy. Four of them, actually. Yeah, that's good enough for them. Um, I wanna, I wanna do that blog. I can't stream super long today, so I wanna make sure that we are able to do that. I don't actually know what I have to do to trigger it. Indigo Disc Epilogue. Mythical Etchaberry? Just eggs. Select Poke Portal. Oh, this is gonna get rid of my Charizard raids, isn't it? Maybe not. It says you don't have to have NSO, so maybe I can be offline. I don't know. Um, Mystery Gift. Get via the internet. Probably gonna reset my Charizard raid. Ah, it's fine. Mm 
Mr. Cole. Petra Berry. Would you ever know to do that? <laughs> um. We need to go to Peachy's door. Ooh, I guess before I do this, let me heal up the Pokemon, but I also gonna take a really quick, like, just like one minute break. Refill my water, go to the bathroom. Well, let me, let me revive the team first here. Um, also, I'm kind of curious. Boxes. Where did the Rapagos end up here? Not in my party. I see. Hello, hello. Totally not late. Doing the like end game. DLC content. We finished the main story. There is like an epilogue thing. That we're trying to do. Oh, it's right here. Not this, but... Get it like level level them up. What do we... you walk to and from the storm? Are you feeling better? I hope you're feeling better. You've seen a bunch of stuff from the DLC, but don't remember anything. If you haven't played it at all, by the time you play it, you won't remember anything. <laughs> Maybe? I don't know. I feel like I forgot a lot of the main story already. Like, what happened before what I just recently did. It's fun to, like, actually get through all the story stuff. Cause then I can just like focus on um like finishing up deck stuff and shiny and catching and that kind of stuff. I can finish the main decks in this game too. And I get the shiny charm. So much candy. Okay. Rapagos is now all hyped up on sugar. <laughs> <laughs> Look how cute, though. Like the perfect colors. Um. I don't know if it's good or not, but. <laughs> I 
Oh, but I need to, I'm going to take a really quick break. Just to go refill my water and go to the bathroom. And then, and then we'll start that vlog stuff. So I will be right back. Like one minute. Okay, I'm back. I eat a quick snack. As well. Cough, cough, cough. <laughs> okay, um... I need to go to Peachy's. No, 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 that's not where I need to go. I have really enjoyed this DLC, actually, though. Like, both parts of it were really good. Oh, look at the little Vulpix up there. So cute. Sleeping. Um. There's a dusty old decoration of some sort mixed in with all the daily goods and things. It smells incredibly sweet. Hmm. Hmm? Huh? Decoration appeared to move a little bit. Happy, yo, it's Arvin here. I heard the news. You've been having all kinds of big adventures, huh, little buddy? Cool tram studying abroad. What luck? Uh, yeah, it's been awesome. Yeah, man, I'm jealous to hear that. I wish I could have gone along too. Now that I think about it, it's been one crazy thing after another since you came to our school. I guess you've still been really busy lately, but are things starting to settle down? I was thinking if you have time, and only if you want to, of course. Maybe I could come visit you at your house. Of course, come right over. Seriously? It's such a relief to hear you say that, without even the tiniest hesitation. So I, uh, guess I'll come over. Your house is in Cabo Pauco, right? I'll meet you out front. See you there. Oh. It's gone. Just like that, it disappeared. So mysterious. The hidden treasure of Area Zero Epilogue. 
mochi mayhem. Oh, what are the little dribs? The Splatoon crossover? <laughs> what a random thing, though, to have them have us come here and look at one dessert. Like what? Oh, you know what I also want to check here? I want to check if if my Charizard Razor is still here. They maybe be. They maybe be. It'll be a dragon type. Oh, I think they're gone. I think they're gone. There's just this one. Oh, rest in peace. Pretty Herba Mystica. That's okay. Worth it to finish the story. Um, let me actually change the title though to say that we're doing that plug. Um, there he is. Oh yay, happy. He <laughs> he. Vigor died tag along. Hey there. You're all here. Happy, I, uh, this is all my fault, sorry. You know when I called you and said I wanted to come hang? Well, these two overheard and, uh, well, we weren't just gonna let you hog the chance to visit Happy. It's way more fun to roll together anyways. You say that, but who wants a bunch of uninvited guests? That's just rude. It's totally fine. I guess, if you're fine with it, Happy, then I can't really complain either. Okay, listen up, you two. We're not allowed to cause any trouble for Happy and his mom. Got it? We're going to be the perfect guests today. You bet. I don't know who you think you're educating here, but sure. Whatever. That was such a great meal. I can't believe we got all that after we barged in here out of nowhere. Your mom's cooking is so good, Happy. Right? And she's so pretty. My brain literally glitched when I saw her. I'm so glad you remember me. And look at this huge room. Doesn't make you feel all boxed in like dorm rooms do. It's super cute, seriously. Almost too much for me to take. Oh, it's a Nintendo Switch. You have to tell me what games you got on this thing. I love this squabbed flush. This fluff's to die for. How's everybody doing? Anyone want dessert? I was thinking bringing up some sweets. Sweets? Yes. No, no way. We couldn't possibly ask you for more food. We don't mean to be a hassle. A hustle. I mean a hassle. We don't want to be a hassle. <laughs> oh, sweetie, no need to stand on, on ceremony here. Just make yourself at home and relax. Yes, ma'am. Oh, and uh, Happy, a letter came for you. It's from Kieran? Do you know a Kieran? Yes. Mom. My word, you've been making a lot of friends. Here you are. I'll bring those sweets up in just a few. I hope you all enjoy them. I'll come help. Mm hmm? Namona is so tall. Gah, I want to check out the sweets too. Your mom sure is nice, Happy. You're real lucky. Oh, but uh, what about that letter? Aren't you going to at least open it up? Hmm? Dear Happy, how are you doing lately? I took a leave from school, so I'm back in Masui Town for a while. My sis came back with me too. I know we didn't get much chance to talk after everything that happened in the Underdeps. I'd really like to catch up. If you could swing a visit to get a Kami. Carmine would love to see you, I'm sure. Maybe you could bring your friends from Heldea too. I included plenty of tickets. Who's this Kieran guy? Some new friend or something? Yeah, just a friend. Yeah, I mean, I guess that's good for you and all. Happy Arvin, you're not gonna believe how good this stuff looks. There's too much to carry upstairs. Come on down here and eat. Sheesh. That Namona, hasn't she ever heard of an inside voice? But I guess we better go. Or she'll just keep on shouting. Why are we sitting so awkwardly staring at each other? 
Oh, my poor tummy. I feel like I'll burst if I eat another bite. I think what you're trying to say is thank you so much for feeding us. It was all really delicious. Right? I'll help with the dishes and stuff. Oh, aren't you the sweetest thing? But no need to lift a finger. You kids just take it easy. Thanks, ma'am. You're the best. At least no one has got manners. So I'll give her that. Unlike this one. Huh? Why are you looking at me? Say, uh, happy about that letter. What was that place? Your new pal mansion, Kitakami or something? You really gonna go there and meet this Kirin guy again? Yeah, let's all go. Wait, what? You going somewhere? Oh, uh, did we miss something? Something good? Spill it. Oh my gosh, Nimona. <laughs> I think Nimona ate too many sweets. Are you serious? We're definitely going with you. This Kieran kid was champion of a super elite battle academy, right? I gotta meet him. More like I've gotta battle him. Was it that obvious? <laughs> I kind of feel bad, though. Like, we just invited ourselves along on your trip without asking. The guy said to bring friends, and we're those friends. Even send tickets for us. Yep, friends equals us. Ergo, we get the tickets. You bet we do. This will be my first time going on a trip with friends. It's kind of scary and exciting at the same time. Yeah, now that you mention it, I don't think I've ever taken a trip with a friend either. You're kidding. Well, this is gonna be amazing, so get excited. Yes, I better at least tell the housekeeper over at my place. I'll be away for a while. Why don't we break for now? Do whatever prep we gotta do. Meet up again later. Sounds good. Let's say we meet up again in front of Mesa Goza's southern gate. Roger. See y'all later then. Break. Team. Go. <laughs> Friendship. Thanks for having us over. Oh, did Nimona and the others leave already? Your friends are all such nice kids. I was really glad to meet them all. And now it sounds like you're all about to go have a little adventure together, huh? Well, have fun if you do. No fighting and be sure to look after one another. My mom is just like, oh, you're going to leave? You're going to go on a trip with, uh, by, all by yourself? Again? Bye. <laughs> Come on, chum. Gotta go outside to call a taxi, I guess. That makes sense. That makes sense. Oh, they're all right here. Hey, over here, over here. All right, Happy, did you load up on travel snacks? Your bag full of grub. Oh my gosh, Dad, would you just drop it? I told you, friends, I'm going with friends. No, you don't need to be worried about it. We are perfectly capable of taking our, care of ourselves. Ah, uh, no. It's not going to be an event tour. No one says that. Honestly, I'm hanging up now. <laughs> Suddenly, I'm uh, too tired for any of this. Did you get your old man's okay to go? Yeah. In the end, but I had to put up with his ultra mega annoying dad talk to do it. He just ultra mega cares, little bud. Oh, oh yeah, maybe you're right. Okay, we've all got permission and we're all here. No one forgot anything, right? Then vamos, let's go. Let's go. Welcome back, Spoon.
What are you up to, Spin? Are you playing Fortnite? Lego. Ooh, so this is Masui Town. You all smell that, right? It smells kind of different than Paldea. Ugh, my head's still spinning too fast to see anything. Are we there yet? Maybe you wouldn't have gotten so carsick if you hadn't stared at your phone the whole bus ride. But I didn't know if we'd get signal here. I had to load up on internet goodness while I could. Why, hello them. Uh, hiya. Hiya, indeed. I'm the caretaker here, and it's a pleasure to welcome you to our town. Kieran had mentioned you would all be coming. Happy aside, this is everyone's first time visiting Kitagami, is that right? Yep, yep. Yeah, that's the long and short of it. I see, I see. Well, again, you're most welcome. You can sleep here at the community center. All the rooms have been freshened up for you. Whoa, now that's some thoughtful service. Haha, <laughs> no trouble, no trouble. Now please, relax, enjoy yourselves. But most of all, enjoy Kitagami. Thanks very much, sir. So what about that Kieran guy? Have you heard from him at all? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Excuse me? He doesn't have a smartphone? How is this kid even alive? Uh, he must not want any distractions from training. Think he's at his house? Should we go meet him? Yeah, there's Kirin. Gator, hello, hello. One of your main skins got legified. Let's go. Which one is it, Gator? I wasn't sure. I saw the long list and I was hoping that it was it would be, but I wasn't sure which one we were hoping for. I couldn't remember the name of it. There's a ton of Lego skins, so I don't even know how many. That got added old ones. It seems like they're mostly maybe, uh... Are they mostly Battle Pass ones? There's so many, I don't even know. It's overwhelming to me. Axor? Oh, that's like the Robot Gator one. That should be cool on Lego, too. Happy! Oh man, it's been a long time. Thanks so much for coming. Sorry that I couldn't come meet you at the bus stop. Things have been uh, kind of crazy at home. It's great to see you. <laughs> Thanks. But wait, did you come all by yourself? Nah, I got I brought the whole crew. Yo, we're here too. Hey, nice to meet you. I'm Namona. Oh, Namona, personal space. <laughs> You're Kieran, yeah? Happy told us all about you. Like how great you are at Pokemon battles, right? Ooh, well, I don't know about that, but... <laughs> Dial it back a notch. Or nine. You're scaring him. I'm Penny. Unlike a certain someone, I'm fine with taking friendships nice and slow. And I'm Arvin, Happy's absolute best friend. Staking your claim right from the get-go, huh? Well, I'm Kieran. I met Happy when he came here for that school trip. That's when we became friends. Uh, what else? Oh, I'm a student at Blueberry Academy. Er, I mean, I was a student there. I'm on break right now. Whoa, really? I know how that goes. Same thing happened to me. Penny, don't go sympathizing with the enemy. I thought I could count on you at least keep this interloper at arm's length. Eh, I just get in the feeling we're pretty alike. Wow, well, your friends seem like a quirky group. <laughs> kind of like you, huh? Anyways, a friend of Happy's is a friend of mine. I hope you all have a good time staying in Kitakami. Thanks, now let's battle. I, uh, what? <laughs> that space in front of the community center looked like a good battle spot. Vamos, come on. Does she want me to go with her? Am I supposed to go battle her? You got this, kid. Peter, you despise spring so much you have a hate-hate relationship? Oh no, her allergy is bad. Oh man, she's just as pushy as this is, but like, different? Oh no, I I think I might have made a terrible mistake. This Kieran kid might actually be a good guy. Of course he is, he's friends with Happy. 
Yeah, yeah, that's true. Here we got all the, um... We got all the details on the... Oh, you already saw it. You already saw it. If you saw the skin. We got all the details on the vehicle stuff for tomorrow. In LEGO Fortnite, which is super exciting. You sneeze for 15 minutes non-stop. Oh my goodness. I'm sorry. Are we going here? We're just watching the metal. Okay, do you change your profile pic again? What is it? What is it? It's a gator. Oh, you had this one before. Is gator from FNAF? Question mark. I got completely destroyed. Who the heck is Nimona anyways? She's a champion. Wait, she's a champion in the Paldea region? Okay, yeah, it makes sense she's so good then. Yurian, you're so good. That was awesome. No wonder you were a champion in that fancy pants school of yours. But, but I couldn't beat you. Does it really matter whether you win or lose? Pokemon battles are a blast. Hmm. Yeah, that's true. That's Nimona for you. You get used to it. You okay? You feel like running for the hills yet? Hey now. Not at all. It was a lot of fun. Yeah, I had a lot of fun. See? Hmm. Whoa. Who the heck are you? <laughs> Sis, you okay? Uh, her eyes are looking a little different. They're the same color of the... Ma... Mama mochi 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 carmine mochi 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 is this your big sister Karen do you think she wants it on the battle fund too there's no way that's what's going on here sorry everybody but could you just help me just uh just carry my sister somewhere safe you want us to pick her up and drag her off I mean if you say so Mochi, mochi, mochi. I don't know what's going on. Mochi Madness is the subtitle of the epilogue? Something like that? Carmine ate a mochi that was actually a Pokemon that was actually haunted, or I don't know. Who cursed? You sure you don't want to stay with your sister? She should be okay. Gramps and Grandma look after her during the day. But they must have taken their eyes off of her just a sec earlier. Sorry for making you all help out with that. Oh, I mean, it was no big deal at all. Happy to help out. But, uh, yeah, I gotta ask, is everything okay with your sister? She seemed pretty, uh, riled up. Yeah, she's not usually like that. Well, that's a relief. I think she was just really excited to get to meet you all. You really think that's what that was? Mmm, yeah. That, that's that gotta be why she's dancing that weird dance and screaming mochi mochi. How long has she been doing that? I mean, she's been like that since I sent you that letter, Happy. She was already dancing and all by the time I woke up the next day. No explanation. I guess that really isn't normal, is it? Maybe the other folks in town are right. Maybe this really is a curse. Wait, it could be a curse? Wow, this trip just took a real sudden dive into horror movie territory. I know zilch about curses, but could something like this have happened before? You ever heard any old stories or legends about it? I don't know, Happy already took care of the whole thing with Ogre Bond and the Loyal Three. Sheesh, Happy, you really just rolled on through this town like a little hurricane, huh? My sis may have no filter and be inconsiderate and push people's buttons, but I'd still rather see her be her old self than whatever this is. Yeah, for sure. If there's anything you think we can do to help, just say the word. What? Sure, we'll help you out. I definitely don't believe in horror movie tropes like curses anyways. Yeah, let's do this. If we get to battle a curse, I'm so here for it. <laughs> you guys sure? You don't mind? Friends help one another. Oh, 
happy. No, all of you. Thank you. It's too late to start today, but I'd be really grateful if you could all help me out tomorrow. First, we're going to have a proper welcome party tonight at the community center. Let's do it. Hey, come in. Is there a way to hypnotize allergies out of you? I don't think so. <laughs> do you take any kind of allergy like medicine at all, Gator? I'm not I'm not a I'm not a doctor, but I do take allergy medicine. I take like uh Zyrtec is the name brand of it, but I take like a generic one of it. What is the, what is the Cetirazine. Cetirazine. Or Benadryl or something like that? I don't know. Ask, ask, a, ask a doctor or a nurse or a grown-up. You did take some? Uh, wait, what did I need to do? Curses and supernatural stuff like that are totally unscientific. Nothing scary about them. We need to go have a party. <laughs> I guess. Community center party. I got some soda. Sugar and carbonation, my two love languages. You find peaches, all right? Yeah, it's like right next door. <laughs> there was nobody there, so I just left money on the counter. Do you think that's okay? Oh yeah, the old lady who runs this steps away sometimes, so everybody just does that. No worries. Man, I can imagine anyone getting away with that back in Paldea. Wait, Namona, what's all over your mouth? Were you eating snacks without us? When I see a help yourself sign, I don't ignore it. There was just one mochi left, though. Wait, you had a mochi, Nimona? Hey, Kieran, do you have any idea how to change the channel on this TV? It just keeps playing this. The same tourism video over and over again. Oh, the caretaker hit the remote somewhere, so that video is all we can get on the TV. Okay, crew, new goal, find the clicker so we can all watch a movie or something. It's got to be around here somewhere, right? We just need to find it. Oh, uh, huh. Why didn't I think of that? Time to search this place top to bottom. And then I vote we play big games up on that big screen. <laughs> it's like our own little treasure hunt. Everyone grab a corner. Start searching. I'm in. I'm in. Hehe, <laughs> you agree? My plan is genius, huh? How about this, then? Let's see that whoever finds the remote gets to decide what we do. Hey, Kieran, no fear of getting a head start. These are tablets, but they need to be charged. Hmm, no luck with the drawers and desks there. Guess that would have been too obvious, huh? Hmm? Why is Nimona just like stuck there? Well, this is the exit. I'm trying to go back. Nimona, I'm concerned for Nimona. Hmm, Caretaker never really goes through the here, does he? Maybe it's somewhere else. Looks like a conference room. Probably won't be using this. Oh, what's this sparkly thing in the corner? Hmm, something in this planter. You found the remote control for the TV. What? No way. That means you get to choose what we do. Wowzers, of course you found it first, Happy. Hey friend, you agree with me that we should use that big old screen to play games, right? Huh? Where'd Nimona go off to? Is she in the bathroom or something? No, I was checking around here there earlier. I'm pretty sure I would have seen her go in. She didn't head into the rooms in the back either. I was by the door to the hallway this whole time. I think I know what's going on. 
She must be waiting to jump out and scare us. Mm, I tried her phone, but she's not picking up. You try calling her? I didn't hear her phone ring or anything, and that's weird. Huh, that is weird. So, does that help us figure out where she is? Uh, she's probably outside. Hmm, maybe she was so sad on finding the remote she went outdoors to look for it? I guess that makes sense. Maybe she forgot to get something at the shop. I just hope she didn't wander out of town. Hitokami is dangerous at night if you don't know your way around. I think Happy and I should go look outside. Arvin, Penny, can you stay here for now? What? Bah? What if she comes back while we're all out? We have a better chance of finding her if you stay here and you can call us if she does. That's true. Okay. But be careful out there. We'll hold down the fort till you get back. Let's go, Happy. Do you need more wood? Or, sorry, Spoon needs more wood. You have so much already. Are you going to tear down all the monorails, Spoon? When we have vehicles? Yes, yes you are. Then you're going to have even more wood. More front? Is it, did you make it with frostbite? Uh, uh-huh. There's still some people out. It's hard to tell with the sundown, but I think those two are workers from the orchard. Why don't we go ask them if they've seen the Mona? Oh no, they have bright purple magenta eyes. Excuse us. Mm. Uh, hello? Hmm. Something's off about them. Ma. Ma ma ma. Ma ma ma. Ma ma ma. Mochi. Mochi. Mochi? Not them do. Mo. Mo. Mochi. 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 <laughs> Whoa, what the heck? What's going on? Mochi, mochi, mochi. This is maybe the weirdest Pokemon story ever. <laughs> You're challenged by Pokemon Trainer Shig and Pokemon Trainer Aya. They send out Pokemon? You think a ton. We're gonna need to, uh. Whoa. Mochi, mochi. <laughs> smash. Think go smash. What's with them all of a sudden? Why are they attacking us? Peter says, don't be like the one slur from the Lorax. But more, says Spoon. The spoon is like these people, but instead of mochi, it's more. More wood. <laughs> the Spoon is cursed. Ooh, this song is kind of good, though. Oh, that didn't really do much. But I kind of need the HP. Heli drum, but that's going to get rid of a lot of your health. It's going to be worth it. Keep. Paralyzed. Steel beam. Ooh, why did that hurt me so much? I'm gonna have to heal here. And not just with the draining kids, probably. Uh, I don't know actually though. Moji? Moji. Moji. Okay. 
Oh, they've been defeated. Mo. Chi. It's isn't it amazing how I could predict what they were gonna say. Mo Chi Chi. Mo Chi Chi. Ew, that scared the snot out of me. What's gotten into them? They were perfectly fine when I saw them yesterday. What the heck is going on around here? They are acting like Carmine. Hmm? Hey, you're right. The weird dancing and yelling is what my sis was doing. Did these two get wrapped up in this whole curse thing too? Oh, man. Oh, there's Nimona. I can't believe Nimona vanished at a time like this. We could really use her help. There she is. Oh no. Sure looked like her, all right. She ran off to her Gitakami Hall. Why? Come on. Let's go get her. Well, this person looks possessed, too. Possessed by Moji. Found a mass outbreak of something I don't have yet. Ooh, okay, well, let me slight pause in our adventure here. And Nimona can wait, right? Sure, she'll be fine. She would understand, really. I mean, if anyone would, Nomono would understand. Phantump, a stump Pokemon, ghost and grass type. This Pokemon came to be when the spirit of a deceased child. Possessed a tree stump and now wanders the forest searching for friends. That is creepy. That is creepy, but also kind of cute. Creepy cute. Okay, now that we got that, let's keep looking for Nimona. But also Pokemon. Are you, do you have any emoji? No. Okay. I think I have this bat, yeah? Okay. I don't think I spent a lot of time at night here. Here's some night olings. Oh no. Are these people possessed too? Their eyes are yellow, not pink. Hello there, Kieran, and you too, Happy. Grandma, Grandpa, what are you both doing here? Is Carmine okay? And did you see a girl come by? Slow down, Kieran, one question at a time. Carmine's at home, sleeping in her room. She must have tuckered herself out with all that dancing. Phew, so she's safe. We thought we'd step out while she slept to get some of her favorite noodles from the stall here. A taste of her favorite food might help snap her out of whatever's going on with her. Oh yeah, I hope so. Good thinking, Grandpa. Now, what was that you're asking about some girl coming this way? Hmm? Oh, right. Everyone in town is acting all weird. And one of the girls who came here from Paldea went missing. She's wearing a school uniform. Hmm? Well, now that you mention it, we did run into a girl wearing a uniform not too long ago. You spoke with her, dear. What did she say? Mochi, mochi. Dearest? Oh no. Have some mochi. Hmm. I don't need any mochi right now. Dear. Have some mochi. Eat it. Eat the mochi. Grandma? This is awfully sudden, dear, but I suppose if you insist. Grandpa, don't do it. It's cursed. 
Munch, 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 munch. Nom, 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 nom. All right, I've had some mochi deer. Now can we get back to the question? Hmm. Hmm. Grandpa, are you okay? Mm. Mochi. Mochi. <laughs> I, I hate to laugh at such a, a tragic curse of events, but... Huh? Is Grandma gonna do it too? Yeah. <laughs> moji, moji. Sometimes, you know, laughing is like a coping mechanism when things are very tragic and uh, horrible. And sometimes all you can do is laugh. You gotta be kidding me. Moji, moji, moji. Stop dancing, their bones are gonna hurt. Oh no, they're gonna try to fight us now. I'm gonna swing from the chandelier. Like, see ya. Moji, 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 moji. <laughs> Oh good, my Pokemon healed, or reset their PPs between battles, that's good, because I forgot. Sigaton uses Steel Beam, but Arbok avoids the attack, oh no, oh no, Sigaton hurt. Go for a, a, a draining kiss here. Not very effective, but hopefully it helps heal me up. Not too much, but Mochi? Mochi. Mochi. Oh no. Oh no! <laughs> okay, this is bad. This these are harder than uh, Tarapagos was. Grandma, Grandpa, don't Grandma, and Grandpa, don't mess around. Let me tell you. Um, I think I got a heal tank here. Uncle Tin, <laughs> no. Don't worry. I would never let anything happen to our beloved Tinkaton. Oh man, why'd this have to happen? I guess we got no choice but to beat him. Whoa. Polyroth got burned. Oh no. Here, you got other Pokemon? I hope you do. I drapple. Mochi, mochi. Are you gonna go listen to some musicals? Ooh, what are you gonna listen to? Waitress or hairspray? Ooh. Those are both good. Oh no, take it and paint it. <laughs> maybe maybe see an ogre pond. We'll snap grandma and grandpa out of it. Since they have like an emotional connection. Oh, they're throwing out more. I thought we were done. I thought it was one and done. Grandma and Grandpa are not messing around. 
superpower. It seemed to work well with Rapagos. Oh yeah, superpower is super effective. That should be fine. This is not effective, but gotta do a little extra damage here. Hmm. Eat emoji. 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 Mochi. Oh man, no way. Grimps and Grandma too. Everybody's losing it. It's just a matter of time until it gets me. I'm gonna end up like the, all the rest of them. Calm down, Kieran. You, I have a very anxious mind. Take a deep breath. Sorry. Sniffle, sniffle. I kind of panicked there. Thanks, Happy. Okay, let's think. Before Graham started acting like Carmen, he ate some of that weird moji. Oh, look how cute my new Quaxley phone case is, by the way. I mean, very off topic, but it's still cute. Happy, how are you two doing out there? You okay? Yeah, we're doing okay. Yeah, thank goodness. Just hearing your voice is helping keeping me calm. We got worried because we hadn't heard from you in a while. Decided to step outside and things are weird out here, little buddy. We were attacked by all these folks shouting mochi mochi at us, and we couldn't spot you anywhere, so I was beginning to fear the worst. We're holding tight by that... By that PG's place for the moment, but, uh... Eek! Yeah! There's something here. There's something there! Arvin! Penny? Wa... Yeah! What's wrong? Are you two okay? Oh, crud. This does not look good. Clunk, clatter, clatter, clatter. Boop, boop, boop. Arvin? Hey, Arvin! Oh, no. Something must have got them. The mochi. The mochi got them. Grandma, Grandpa, I'll be back. Don't go anywhere. I still want to find a mono, but we gotta get to PG's and check on Arvin and Penny. Come on! Why? Why? No mono should be right here. But okay. I don't want to abandon my friend. I'm gonna fly though. I'm gonna take a shortcut and look for Pokemon. Even though, <laughs> you know, dangerous situation going on here. No, I'm gonna pick up items too because, you know, cherry berries make me happy. Another coping mechanism. <laughs> Slash compulsion. <laughs> Oh, thankfully we've made it back, and here's Arvin and Penny. But are they okay? That person over there is Mochi Mojin. Their eyes look normal. Arvin, Penny! There you guys are. What happened? Uh, yeah. Sorry about hating up on you like that. Probably gave you the wrong impression. Yeah, yeah. It was all Penny's fault. She went into full panic mode and ran smack into me with her head. So, I dropped my phone. Can you blame me? Look at the people in this town. Something is seriously wrong with them. Never mind whatever that weird thing was. Weird thing? What are you talking about? It was like round and little and weird. Just where is this little hallucination of yours? You sure you weren't just seeing stuff? It was real. I really saw it. I swear. Sure you did. I think I might have figured out why everyone is acting so strange. Until we know for sure, though. Maybe you should, uh... Whoa! Heads up, guys. There's something up there. Look up there. Oh, it's totally the mochi. 
What's the thing I saw earlier? Is it a drone? No. I think it's a Pokemon. Whoa. No. Oh, the Moshi's right in their mouth. Happy, close your mouth. Oh, Happy's like, oh, that's not vegan. <laughs> oh, Kieran got knocked out by it. Oh, no. Penny, Arvin. Huh? Is this Mochi? It's kind of sweet. I like it. No, wait. Don't eat those. Whoa. What? I feel funny. Yeah. Are you two okay? Mo. Mo. Moji. 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 It was an Alaskan bullworm? What? Yeah? <laughs> Moji. 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 Arvin. Moji. Moji. Huh? Is Arvin embarrassed? But more importantly, I'm so sorry. If only I'd managed to warn them in time. Those weird mochi came from that thing. A chong? Moji. Moji. Hey, no fair. That jerk's using them as a shield. We've got to find some way to get the two of them to calm down. What is with the mochi? It's a curse spoon. Battle Arvin and Benny? Do I have to? I mean, it says I have to. It's my objective. Um, Hold on. I got to make sure my team is okay. Yeah, they look like they got healed up after the last battle with Grandma and Grams. What was that noise? That was not me. That was not me. It was the Moji? Moji, Moji. What is Arvin doing? You're challenged by Pokemon Trader Penny and Pokemon Trader Arvin. Greetings to Umbreon. Momo. Moira is here? Mochi mochi. Greeting is so happy even though it's getting beaten up. <laughs> G. What? That's not emoji. Umbreon uses Psychic. Super effective on Polyrap. Arvin says, oh, my boss Steph. Oh, no. Don't make me fight him, boss Steph. No. Oh, the feels. The feels. have 1628 wood now spin it won't all go into your storage oh my goodness Arg, ichi chibi what are why are they saying different things why are they not saying mochi anymore oh penny has an eevee backpack so only fights with eevee illusions I forgot that if that's how it was before. Uh, draining Kez? Go for my boss stuff since I don't think it's gonna be very effective on Sylveon. Mochi! Oh no, Polyrath down. Sylveon uses Moon Blast. That should not be very effective. Beyond. Yeah. Prince is a Porygon Z. 
I'm just reading gifts again. On my Mazda. Oh, not necessary. Bruno and I should be coordinating a little better. So it's a cloister. Gigaton hammer on Sylveon. One shot. Mochi? The garage in the game is going to be so useful now. Oh, true. I didn't even think about that. Uh, wait. I should probably drain kiss again. Leafy on one shot by Porygon. Z. Hold on, I think Porygon is glitching out. Liquidation. That doesn't do much. Finish Moth Gorgon. No? Okay, fine. I won't. <laughs> there you go. Defeated them. It doesn't make them snap out of it though. Michi. Mochi. 33,000 dollars in prize money. Did I just steal my friend's money? Oh, the Pokemon just ran away. You see that? I just went on the other side. Arvin Penny, I'm really sorry, guys. Where do you think you're going? You're next. Eh? Cha cha cha. Wait. You're in throw a Pokeball. Wait, where did it go? <laughs> How did they get so far so fast? I needed a berry. I was hungry. Um, oh, they're up here. It's got to be somewhere around here. They followed us. Wait, is that... Nimona? Thank goodness you're okay. Hmm. Mochi. Mochi. I should have guessed. Mochi, Mochi, match. Even when possessed by an evil curse, nothing can stop Nimona's enthusiasm for battles. Did she just say match? Yes, even the Mochi couldn't override her battle mania completely. Run, run! Aw, oh, man, it's got control of Nimona. There's no way I can get a hold of her. 
or hold her off. Oh no, Moji! Moji is the whole village of Kitakami. This is bad. Everybody from Asui is coming here. Oh, that's right. Kitakami is the region. Sorry, sorry. <laughs> Watch my back for me. Right. Good luck. I'll focus on keeping the villagers from getting in closer. Happy, you do your best with Nimona. And whatever that thing is. Mochi, Mochi, Madge, Mochi, Madge, Mochi, Madge. She snaps out of it just to do her trainer pose. I don't know why I ended up using Tinka Ten so much here. Just because I had Tinka at the beginning of my um. Mochi, let's have a Mochiful Madge. I think go smash. Oof, that's good. Mochi. Ouchi. <laughs> oh, mo -o. Well, I mean, I'm fine with Tink. I think we're good. Oh my goodness. One little smushy. Moji, <laughs> Mochi lore getting more interesting? It's interesting, that's for sure. That's one way to put it. You could think casually slowly. I mean... I did like hyper train this thing a ton for the other gear in battle at the end of the story for the DLC. She did go down once here in one of the battles. Uh, Rastalize Giga Ton Hammer. <laughs> You made a bunch of garages spoon, nice. One shot. We don't talk about that one time. It might have been twice, actually. I don't know. But we'll, we'll be okay, we won't talk about it. Oh, I thought that was giving me the end. But it's about to be, though. Oh. Oh. Let's hope Tinka then goes first there. <laughs> we don't talk about the alleged two times then? Oh. I mean, Tink is, Tink is carrying right now. And look, Tink has like an axe inside of their brain. And still just cruising along here. <laughs> for rooting so much though let me, let me go ahead and uh make sure tink is in peak condition for the rest of this battle with a little, little magic potion
Draining Kiss super effective? Okay. Didn't look very super effective to me. This when you're going to expand one so it can hold a hauler. My hauler is just going to be a whole house, I think. I'm gonna forget my big house build I was doing. I'm just gonna have mobile, mobile base. That way I don't have to worry about ha about like having all my stuff with me. Or, like having to go between bases is just gonna always be in my hall arm. <laughs> just stacks of massive chests. Um. Oh no, they avoided the Giga 10. I guess we maybe just draining Kiss this out. Van life? True. Ultimate van life. Just base life. Mobile base. live in a van down by the river i mean dreams come true it's a tiny house it's a happy little house if you will um we'll just try this again hopefully this works this time no no tick is gonna die Ding, no oh it's so dramatic too Sad, sad. <laughs> we'll swap in chestnut. I'll revive. I'll revive. We 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 we, we gotta we gotta do this a very particular way here now. Tinkathun. Back from the dead. Zombie Tinkathun. Legend three times just casually added that part on VOD. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> Things to like, what? That doesn't affect me. Think. Going in for a big old smooch. Super effective. Draining kiss. Gudra faints. Skeletor. She's not done yet. I thought she, I thought that was gonna be it. Nimona. Nimona not, not messing around here. Full team, I think. Um nothing from Tink is effective here. Mm. <laughs> and we're almost out of draining kisses. And the Mona's terastalizing. <laughs> what could possibly go wrong? Tink was just in a silly, goofy mood. No, Tink is now a zombie. Not a mochi zombie, thankfully, but um, zombie nonetheless. Yeah, I think this is the last one. Here I go, Chi. Torch song. Super effective. What about this though? Not quite enough. Not quite enough. Oh no. Not done yet. Match. 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 Mochi. Another torch song. Oh. No! <laughs> Ding! No! Okay, okay. I, I 
Tink is just taking a nap. Tink is just taking a nap. You believe? You believe, but you may be in a denial. This is the very last piece of story content in this game. So, you know, for the poetic, the poetic, uh, I don't know, reasons. M nostalgic. Sentimental reasons. We're going to go out the way that we started battling the Mona in the story of this game. With our beloved starter, Quack of Val. Formerly Quagsley. With an Aqua Step. And a KO. Tinkaton. Gonna wake up from the nap. And celebrate with us later, so. <laughs> Nimona's defeated. Oh, Nimona's happy about it. Moji. Skills. Moji. Ducky Momo? What <laughs> Quackaballs possessed by Mochi too? Ma? Cha cha cha. Defeat the mysterious Pokemon. Hey, hey. What are these noises it's making? It's making like serious fart noises. <laughs> Does Mochi's make it make it fart? I don't even know. Um, <laughs> it's got a rumbly and it's tumbly, like Winnie the Pooh. Cha cha cha. Oh, it just wants some chai, chai cha. It wants some tea with its mochi. Oh no, Terrapagos, you're not supposed to be out here. My tea mortar is almost up. Terrapagos, you're so cool, but no. Wakabong. Spoon, you're gonna get on at 8 a.m. Are you still on break, Spoon? I thought your spring break was last week. You have two weeks spring break? Or go or are you gonna get on before school? Quackaball's poisoned? And seeing little baby duckies. We're off to a great start. You have two weeks of spring break? Oh my goodness, lucky. You get more spring break than me. <laughs> Grown ups don't usually get spring break, by the way, sadly. <laughs> I'm taking it. I don't know if it was a good idea for me to terrestrialize right away, actually. Quackaball is confused. Me too, me too, Quackaball. <laughs> nice, nice. Quacky McQuaxel Man Jr. You damage it. I missed the rest of the dialogue. That's okay. I'm sure it wasn't important. Uh, keep it up. You got this. Okay, I saw it on the replay. <laughs> uh, liquidation. Quackaball snapped out of it. Quackaball. Quackaball is... Crushing it. Crushing it. Aw, oh, man. I can't hold out much longer. Hurry up. Finish it, Happy. I forgot, I forgot that Kieran is battling the entire rest of the village while I'm doing this. <laughs> uh, what does this do? Focus this energy so we can do more damage in the next attack. Okay, let's try it. Let's try it. Maybe we can one shot from here. Aqua Step. Ah, 
Wow. Okay, not quite. Not quite down, but we totally got this. No. Quack of all no. Oh my goodness. Okay, I think I think I have to I think I have to revive Quack of all. I don't even know how that happened. That was like a full health. It's not terrestrialized or anything. So we're gonna sacrifice Sylvia on here. Take a ton of skill taking a nap. You call it rigged? <laughs> it's definitely rigged. For sure. Oh my goodness, what? It's hacking for sure. Did you just see that? Can I terrestrialize again? No, I can't. Um. Oh no. Quagamal's gonna go down again. <laughs> what is this move? It just insta kills everybody. Does it keep this move? Does this move always insta kill everything? These are level 100 hyper trained Pokemon. Um, I mean, <laughs> I guess I'll revive. I, I guess it doesn't even matter if it's a max revive, right? Because I'm just. If it's gonna go down, Quack Ball is always the Aqua Step move always goes first. I believe. Oh, apparently Terrapa goes though. Fine. Maybe it's because of the poison. Why did they get to go first there? <laughs> oh man. This is not going great. This is not going great. Is this like a story thing? Like, is it meant to just wipe your whole team? Do I, 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 I mean, I, no, 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 oh, oh, that was horrible. I max revived the wrong Pokemon. I swapped out after the disc one died. So that counted as a turn. Hmm. I'm so mad that I wasted a max revive. It's fine. I have the item printer. We'll get more. Rapagos was poison still. Wait, is there something else I can give, give, um, can I give Quackaball something to, to prevent this? 
Item prevents Pokemon on your side from having their stats lowered in battle. Donald that attracts the attention of Pokemon guarantees to escape from any battle. I don't think so. I don't think so. These all just heal status events. There maybe is like a held item I've had, but I don't have it equipped. Tropicos just casually beating the shield. I know, right? Did I antidote it? Excuse you. Mr. Meanie Pants. <laughs> Me not knowing what to do here. I like that we could like beat some of the hardest battles in the game like no problem and this is what is giving us trouble. Um... This probably is just going to do the same thing again, but we'll see. Oh, it used a different move. Maybe it ran out of the other one, finally. <laughs> but Quackaball, you, you only really got one shot at this, buddy. I believe in you. But on this long, arduous journey together. Oh no. Fuck of all is confused. You got this. You got this. You know these steps. Like the back of your hand. There we go. <laughs> The wild Petra run. Thanes. Look, it's slowing down. Now's your chance. Catch it in a Pokeball. Why is this music? This music is bumping. It's over. Maybe. I don't know. Everyone is still cursed, I think. <laughs> Petra run. Subjugation Pokemon. Poison and ghost type. It's peach-shaped shell. Serves as storage for a potent poison. It makes poisonous mochi and serves them to people and Pokemon. So the box is... Did you get it? Then everybody else should be. Oh no. Oh, 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 I was worried there. I thought they were still cursed. Hmm, what are we all doing here? How did I end up at Loyalty Plaza? Everybody's back to normal. Happy, Kieran. The last thing I remember is getting to the shop. What happened? So first, dot, 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 dot. And then after that, dot, 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 dot. But then they all... Hmm. Seriously? So all that mochi mochi stuff was because of some Pokemon? See, see, I told you it was real. Unlike dumb horror movie tropes like curses. That round little monster was behind everything, just like I said. Er, when did you say that? Anyways, Happy went and caught the thing, as he does. Ha 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 ha. He sure did. Wait, what about Nimona? Hmm? Nimona's Nimona slowly opens her eyes and says, Hey, nice battle. Want a battle? 
let's battle. <laughs> Ugh. Nimona, are you feeling all right? Mochi match. Gah, the curse wasn't lifted. Huh? What's going on? Did we find the remote? That's what you want to know? Sheesh. Glad you're back to normal now at least. Yep. Morning, everybody. You know, I had this crazy realistic dream that I was battling happy. It was awesome. Sign me up to have that dream again. <laughs> Nimona really is something. Yep. Sure is. Kiki and happy. Sis, Gramps, Grandma. What the heck is going on? Why is everyone up here? Someone better start explaining. Actually, huh? What a weird feeling. Somehow it feels like I'm seeing you for the first time in ages. <laughs> Giggle. Pan up to the sparkly beautiful stars. Fade to black. Several days later. Ogre Pond's adorable. True. True. Oh, hello. All packed here. Everybody got their stuff together. So we're heading back to Baldea already, huh? We got caught up in a pretty hairy situation, but this trip was still a blast. My arms and legs are still killing me from all that dancing. I'm not sure. I think the reason Terrapagos survived that is because Terrapagos is like all of the types at once. But maybe only when terrestrialized. I'm not sure how that works yet. Hey, you guys. Are you really going home already? No one will mind if you stayed a little longer. I'll come back again. Don't worry. I gotta finish my Pokedex. Yeah, you better. Hey, uh, happy everyone. Thank you all so much for coming. Nah, we should be the ones thanking you for showing us such a good time. And the food, man. Mm -hmm. Chef's guess everything we hear was so good. Especially the mochi. The festival was a lot of fun, too. I even got to buy a Vivi mask. What more could you want? <laughs> well, good. I'm glad you liked it here. Time really flew by. Just goes to show how much fun we were having, huh? Wish I could fit in more battles against both of you, though. Are you kidding me? You battled each of us like a dozen times or more. Welcome to the Nimona Survivors Club. I really am happy I got to meet y'all. I've been thinking about it a lot, and I'm going to give Blueberry Academy another shot. I'm really going to go for it this time. You got this. Yeah, thanks, Happy. Aw, I guess that means my vacation's over, too. Time for me to head back to school, too, then. Hey sis, thanks for like coming with me here and everything. This has been great, seriously. I'm real glad I got to come here and meet you all. And Kieran, I really am sorry for trying to flex on you the way I did when I first got here. Huh? Were you? I didn't even notice. Shade. Uh, don't worry about it, Arvin. Feel free to flex on Kiki as much as you like. I'll allow it. Uh, okay. <laughs> Wow, looks like Carmen's another one with a big personality, huh? Yeah, sorry about her. Mm, excuse me? Who do you think you're apologizing for? And you guys, what do you mean by big personality? <laughs> giggle, 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 giggle. Pan to the beautiful sky. The hidden treasure of Aries here. Epilogue. Mochi Mayhem. The end. When you're back, you just finished eating. Trapagos had too much plot armor. Mm -hmm. Oh, ooh. we're flying. We're zooming. There's a dragon, not dragonite there with us in the air. And just like that, friends, we have finished, I believe, all of the story inside of Pokemon. Scarlet and Violet and the Indigo Disc and 
the uh, the other one, the other one, <laughs> the other half of the hidden a treasure of Area Zero DLC. What is it called? The other? what is it called? Again? Totally remember. Totally not forgetting. Totally not forgetting. Um, totally not scrolling on the channel page to our other streams of it. To look up the name again. Totally not. Um, teal mask, the teal mask. That's right. How could I possibly? I mean, I didn't forget. What are you talking about? Uh, <laughs> so I will, I will keep streaming some Pokemon games. I also, uh, I need to finish my Pokedex, all three Pokedex actually. Um, and I do though, did recently just buy a copy of Pokemon Sword and I've not played it at all ever or watched any content about it or anything so it'll be brand new to me i know some of you have already played through it but i think i'll do that on the channel um i am doing some playthroughs of other pokemon games off stream um i'm playing through pokemon x on the 3ds i've been i haven't really actually played too much of it lately but it was also i started a um a fire red playthrough from game boy advance um, I've never played that either, so, but I'm doing those ones off stream, but Pokemon Sword, I feel like there's a lot of story there, this is a lot of content, so maybe once we, uh, finish up our dexes here, and as you see, I still have, like, I've got some stuff to do here, this is just, this is just the Kitakami one. I'm scrolling fast, but all these empty spots on the shelf we gotta be filled i'm actually i think better off on the uh on the indigo disc one just because i and a lot of these two are going to be starters that i just need to or like baby evolutions i need to level up there is still a lot here though but i think like again a lot of these are like once we get past this part it's gonna be mostly starters which i've caught i think most of them there's a couple i still have made a list on the last stream but so do we'll, we'll do all that we'll do all that and then we can still like we can still visit blaze scarlet velvet maybe do some shiny hunting i don't know I'm really enjoying pokemon a lot lately <laughs> it's 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 a uh, chill more chill than splatoon for overwatch or fortnite for sure <laughs> <laughs> I don't have a lot of chill options. I guess Minecraft is chill, is chill too. I don't know though. I'm, I have not personally been in a very Minecrafty mood lately. But maybe, maybe it'll come back to me when there's a, especially when there's a, a big update. I don't know when the next Minecraft update is coming out. But. Updates usually tend to inspire me a lot to play Minecraft. <laughs> Sadly, Minecraft only updates once a year. Room room thingies. Oh yeah, that's for sure. We'll definitely tomorrow be checking out the Lego Fortnite updates. Uh, update rather. <laughs> With cars and vehicles. Um, yeah. So join us for that tomorrow. There's not enough of us to do a raid or anything. So what I'll do is I'll send I'll send y'all. I'll send you all over to our happy little chat. I guess in case you want to keep hanging out there. Thank you all for being here, though. If you haven't already, do me a quick favor. Hit that thumbs up button, the like button on the stream. It really does help. So much. It just takes a sec. Um, I also want to give a special shout out to our channel members. We got executive producers Tassiana and 23 Davy D. Producers Black Ice, T, Grilled Waffle Strips, Hog, Zari, Hyperspeed, Hyperspeed, Jaden, Gator, Bio, Bella, Jaden Cool Gamer, GGX, Don Lewis. Production assistants, SkyFi, Annie, Mastermind Josie, and Agent Aid. 
Thank you, thank you, thank you. If you want to become a channel member, help support me. The channels are Happy Little Community. Click the join button either on the stream or on the channel page. Have I seen your two clips? Ooh, I haven't, but I definitely keep clipping and I will, I have a tab open and I'll check them all out. And I, like I said, in that community tab posted on stream, I'm going to try to um, either make shorts out of them or, and or turn them into like a montage for our BRB screens and maybe our opener. I'm not sure yet, but, and I will credit whoever does the clip. So like either on screen or, or in the description. Utasi did some clips too. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> I I actually want to go watch these out. Spoon's like, please help. I'm dying of laughter. Cry emoji, cry emoji. What is that? What are they? I'll look at them. I'll look at them. Um. <laughs> Thank you all so much. Um. Yeah. I'll talk to you all tomorrow for Lego. I'll, I'll be more on time than I was today. <laughs> today was late, late, late happy. For sure. <laughs> but better late than never and that was the alternative was me not streaming today so i can see the clips now yeah they changed it um if you want to see your clips um on youtube on the website it's on the left hand side in like the bar there it says there's a thing that says your clips it's by like watch later and your clips and if you have a channel and content or whatnot you can now um, when you go to that Your Clips tab, there's the one that says Buy Viewers, so I can see the clips that everybody makes. So, like, I have the burb one <laughs> from way back in the day of me not knowing where the burb is. There was a repeat of that, actually, <laughs> on a Pokemon stream recently with, from Terrence. Where I got a Pokemon and didn't know where it went, and it was in my party. <laughs> I think you were here for that, actually, Tessie. You may or may not have clipped me avoiding the donut because of being vegan. Oh, <laughs> that's funny. Um, I'll I'll look at them. I, I, I like I do actually have a tab open of them. I just hadn't hadn't gone to it in a few days. I did see that people were clipping. Okay, talk to y'all later. Have a good night. Bye. <laughs>